So, today we are going to fix my stearman. Well, it's not broken, but that landing gear here, if you can see, um, it's wobbly. keeps breaking out. I tried it with several glues, with wood glue. Don't try super attack on those, because it is going to eat your styrofoam. And yeah, it's going to break the plane. And we are going to stick those supports down there as well. Because those are not that good for it. Um, but that's not that good because there is tape on there. And yes. So we are going to glue. Hot glue. with the hot. We're going to try it with hot glue today. What I'm basically going to do is I'm going to um, just apply some hot glue. And... Then hopefully it's going to stay in place. Yeah. Not too happy with this. Oh, wait. Okay. Great. Did it. Think it's good. I think it's good. Down here a little bit maybe. And great, so we glued it down. That's great, so that's done. Okay, now we're just gonna let it sit there for one minute so it can dry, and yeah. Okay, so it should, it's not, there's not a minute over, but that wasn't a minute, but yeah, we're going to see what's, if it is, yeah, it's dry already, so let's put the landing gear on, I'm going to put it on and put the hot glue on away now, for now, sun here please, and And it's successful. As you, as you can see, if I'm pushing it down there, before it was staying where I pushed it, but now it's coming back. That's great. So that did work better than everything else. So now I'm going to apply some hot glue to the sides as well, now that I know that it works. So I'm really secure that it holds up for every single flight I'm doing. That's important that and if you do that at home, take your time, otherwise it's not going to work out for you. That works. So, now we are going to glue down those blue things. Uh, support structures, I don't know what you call them actually. That those are good on there. Try to make it as flat as possible so it's not gonna do anything to the aerodynamics of the plane. And on those UMX planes, or general on those little planes, you have to make sure, even if the other side isn't broken, you have to make sure to do the same on the other side. Otherwise there is too much weight on the other side and it's going to fly all squirrely and eventually you're going to crash and we don't want that to happen, right? So, uh, 
Great, so we did this. Doesn't look too bad. Looks actually quite good. What I did here. So just removing the last access. You can just melt it with the nozzle of the hot glue gun. I think we're done with this plane. Okay, great. This works, so let's remove all that stringy shit from the what the hot glue gun did. Put the landing gear on, do test it another time, that landing gear, look if it's straight and everything. Here, is that you can see it, and it's actually it's straight as well. Super. So let's, let's put that plane away, that little baby plane. I don't know. I have the champ as well. I don't know if there is something wrong with him. No, actually everything's all right. I'll just have to cover that hole there. There is not. That, those holes are n normal, but I made a dent here, and I don't know if it affects the aerodynamics or something, but I'm going to cover it with hot glue. So, let's do that. So. Do... That did not work too good. Let's try it again. Putting it up here. A little more. And should work now. Wait a moment before you put your finger on to make it straight. Otherwise, it's going to stick to your finger and then you ruined your plane. Okay, so we did this. Doesn't look too bad, looks actually better than before, my opinion. You can see I did it here. You can see it shine a little bit shiny on the camera. So yes, that's basically everything on that plane. That was not really broken. The steerman wasn't the steerman wasn't broken as well. It just had the problem with the wobbly landing gear. That's solved. Finally. Yes, that's great. So my two UMX planes are done. So I'm going to show you. I, I'm i not going to really show you, but I have big planes as well. Look, that's my multiplex phone one. Great plane. Had it, I think, for two or three years now. But that's my multiplex Easy Star 2. I had this one for three years, three or four years, no I think three, that's my stunt plane, it's kind of messed up though, not working that too great, um, that's my RC car from Traxxas, the Ford Fiesta ST Rally, I upgraded it with, um, with, uh, brushless motors. So yeah, that was it for this video. Bye